Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. If it's first time visiting my channel, welcome to my channel. My name is Toya and I'm here to do a reading for y'all. So hit that like and subscribe button. Thank y'all for the likes and subscribe this far. And let's get into this video, y'all. Uh, I already pulled a few cards. Uh, so what I pulled is that you guys are very, very spiritual, okay? And I feel like you guys have been working overtime to protect your energy here, okay? You guys have definitely been doing whatever you got to do to protect your energy. I definitely feel like y'all have not been worried about your haters, the naysayers, your enemies, people who thought they was bullies to you. It's like you're in an energy where you're not stressing. Like I said, you are free-spirited. You're not worried about anybody. You're not worried about no type of drama. You don't care who feels what way about you, but you're protected. You're protecting your energy. You're doing whatever you got to do to protect your energy, okay? And I feel like y'all started this um, habit or whatever this is of protecting your energy probably like a few weeks or a few months back. Could have been a few days back. So if it's only been like a few days for you, keep that energy up, okay? Keep doing that. Keep protecting your energy in whatever way you have been protecting your energy. Like I said, whether it's brushing your shoulders off, whether it's not caring, whether it's blocking everybody, whatever it is for you, it is definitely like whatever you're doing is healthy, okay? So continue to make these healthy habits. It says practicing healthy habits can be hard, but staying consistent uh, but stay consistent for more results or for better results here. So, yes, stay consistent. Continue to protect your energy. Continue to shut them down before they can even come in and try to bully you. Like, whatever it is that you're doing, it's got you in the energy where you're just, you're not stressing. You're you're on chill mode here, okay? So, what's going on with these bullies, these mean guys, these mean girls, these people that want to come at you whichever way or they wish they could bully you, whatever this is. They realize that, like I said, you have set yourself up in an energy where you don't want drama and they cannot just come towards you and start drama, okay? You have literally set your boundaries up really, really well, okay? Now, I do feel like one of these bullies or some of these bullies, they have tried to basically overstep your boundaries, but like I said, you've made your boundaries very clear. So, some, somebody here does want to sabotage you, but like I said, at the end of the day, you're protected, you got it. Your angels got it. Your ancestors got your back. God got your back. You're good. But somebody is trying to sabotage you or they have been trying to sabotage you. But the thing is, like I said, you're in an energy where you're around people in situations uh, where there is no drama here. Everybody that you're surrounded by and everything that you're surrounded by is all love. OK, so you separated yourself from these haters. You like, oh, wait, I'm in the midst of haters. I'm, all, I'm in the midst of people that don't like me. Let me go over to, here to the people that are basically on the same vibration as me. OK, so that's what you did. So you're dead smack in the middle of like a bunch of other high vibrational people. So when this person tries to come in to sabotage you, they cannot sabotage you. They cannot stop you because these other high vibrational people are going to be looking at them like, what the fuck are you on? Like, leave him alone. Leave her alone. You're a hater. Like, they know that they're going to get called out because the people that you have surrounded yourself by, they are genuine as well. They are protected as well. They are spiritual as well. They're also an energy where they ain't stressing. They're not around these bully low vibrational like energy so like i said this person could not easily come around and try to point the finger at you they cannot easily come around and try to sabotage you because everybody that is in your energy will literally know you're hating <laughs> you're this you're that okay i do feel like this is something that this person like i said this person or these people they're still gonna keep trying uh they keep trying to manifest these results but like i said you're protected you're in a very safe place you're in a in a place where it's safe to share whoever you're connected to is safe to share i don't care if this is on social media i don't care if this is with a group of people or a new friend group a new job it's safe to share it's safe to connect with these people because these people are like you okay and like i said you have really worked hard to protect your energy from this person or from these people um, it says, make sure you're on the same vibration of what you're trying to manifest. It's like these people are trying to just bully energy. They're trying to manifest, like I said, them to be able to sabotage you. Like they want to be able to sabotage you, but they ain't on the right. Like they cannot even get into the crowd because the crowd, whatever it is, where you got going, is too high vibrational. So everybody that is surrounded by you or connected to you at this point in time, like I said, will look at them like, what the fuck? Like, what is Lord Voldemort trying to do over here? Like, it's that type of energy. Um, so, yeah, this person definitely tried to sabotage you, but they, they don't have access to you. Okay? 
some of y'all, there may be new energy trying to sabotage you or whatever, but they're weak as fuck. They they have no experience, okay? I know that, I don't know how else to explain it. It's almost like let's say the devil is recruiting new haters. So is God though. But it's like the people that the devil are sending to come at you are like, like I said, they're not very experienced at being hated. They're not good at it. Like, it doesn't bother you. You sitting there smoking like, damn, look at that little ass ant trying to cuss me out. Like, it's like funny. It's almost funny. So they're not even at that vibe. They're not even, it's like somebody wishes they were a big bad demon and they're just a little bitty demon. Like, it ain't even to be funny, but yeah. They're not on that vibration yet. They're not. They have to go a little lower. They're not there yet. But you, at the end of the day, whenever they get to where they're trying to get to, to, I guess, fuck with you, to sabotage you, you're going to be so high up that they still cannot get you. Like, they still won't be a match for you. So, like, every... It's like every um good energy has a bad energy for its match. You get what I'm saying? Like, a low vibrational energy. The devil done sent in something that's like puny to try to get you like to try to come at you but you're just like anyway <laughs> i'm glad i started manifesting then or i'm glad i started working on my anger now like none of that is getting to me okay so yeah keep doing what y'all are doing I definitely see you guys being in an energy where people are loving you. People love your energy. Maybe you're the it girl. Maybe that's what they don't want. Maybe that's what they're trying to sabotage for you. They don't want people to look at you in this energy where you're that girl. You're that guy. You're that guy. They don't want you to be looked at as the queen of um, wands. I do feel like some of you guys, you have a new beginning or you're expecting a new beginning. They keep trying to sabotage. It's not working. It's not going to work. Um, some of you guys, like I said, a new community like accepted you with open arms. And it's like a community of just really divine people. You could have uh, met a divine masculine. He accepted you with open arms. Some of you guys, you could have met a divine masculine and his family is everything. like, Or his family's like everything. Or you could have met a divine feminine. Her family is everything. They very supportive people. These could be the high vibrational people that are like, what you on? Like, chill out. Okay, but yeah, you guys are very spiritual, very protected. You're not stressed at all. Continue to practice those healthy habits. Just know that you are like far, 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 far reach from your hater. Your hater is like, ah, haters, hater is mad as hell. But they're trying to hide it. They're trying to sabotage you, but they're trying to come off normal right now. But when they strike, like I said, it's not going to work. Because they're going to try to blame you for something crazy. And people are going to be like, what are you talking about? <laughs> people are, this person needs to go do some inner healing. Or these people, they need to go do some inner healing. Because like I said, it's like they want to blame you for some shit. What are they blaming the collective for? Because they're lost. Because they don't know who they are. And you won't come back around. I don't know. These people are really lost. They don't know who they are. They need to do some inner healing. And you won't come back around. They missed the opportunity with you. Maybe you're spiritual. Maybe you were sent to help them. But they all tried to bully you. And it don't have to be like you're a terrorist. It can be anything. But you're spiritual. You were sent to help them or some shit. But they all sabotage you or they all came together to try to bully you. But they really need help. They're, like they really are lost as hell in life. And they know they missed the opportunity with you. Some of y'all these people are dick riders. But yeah, they want to blame you because they're lost in life. Because they miss maybe maybe it's because they missed the opportunity. What they got to do with you? Maybe because you don't fuck with them, you're over it. Like, it's just the energy of you being over it. You being like, whatever. I don't care. I'm going to be who I am. I'm going to connect with who I want to. And I'm proud of who I am. I'm proud of what I got going on. But maybe these are people who did not want you to be proud of this. 
but they know that you're very spiritual. It's almost like you were supposed to help them, but they didn't miss that train because they all tried to bully you or they all tried to be mean to you or they all tried to a key key like something was funny. But now they missed the opportunity to be healed by a genuine person, a mature man or a mature woman. So now their mission is to, I guess, try to sabotage you, but it's never going to work because the people that you're connected to now, they know that you're genuine. Their family or whoever they're connected to, it's like you're being adopted by genuine energies because these bully energies tried to, they like, they really tried to. Yeah, your ancestors guided you away from these people or guided you away from this connection or this it could be your own city, state, town. It could be anything. Yeah. You intuitively knew. It's all right. It's time to get up out of here. And now you're not stressing. Now you're in the energy where you're good. <laughs> There's nothing to stress about. And now these people, like I said, it's like they're chasing after somebody that's like too high up. We're going to sabotage you. Well, first, you got to get a little stronger to even reach me. Like, you, you ain't even my equal in villain. <laughs> you know, like, you got to get a little bit stronger. But this is what somebody fantasizes about. Like, somebody wants to get stronger so that they can beat you. But you're, at the end of the day, your boundaries is too strong. I don't care how strong they got or try to get what they fantasize about doing, what they wish they can do. They ain't on a vibration to do that. And when they do get there, you're going to be totally somewhere else. You too creative. So a lot of y'all, you, you just vibe too high. This is just a group of miserable people. Y'all missed y'all healing. Y'all need to go heal, go within. So now this could have been people, you, you could have had like a nice conversation with them. I'm telling you, it's like you were, these could have been people that were trying to get to know you or you were trying to get to know them or you were supposed to get to know them or they were supposed to get to know you, but they didn't, or they were supposed to uplift you. Like, let's say your hometown, but they didn't not want you to be the star. That's all it is. But at the end of the day, you're still the star. You're still doing your thing. You still, you still the boss of your own world. You still the boss in whatever you're doing. If this is an entrepreneur, they didn't want you to be an entrepreneur. They didn't want you to be, like I said, a, the star in your own show. Whatever it is that you're doing, they just did not want that for you. They really wanted to sabotage it. Some of y'all, they wanted to be where you are now. But they have to use the low vibrational energies to be where you are now. Somebody realized they missed the opportunity. And you're in your own lane and you just, you're not worried about nobody or your drama. So keep doing what y'all doing. I mean, I guess the haters or whoever these people are just going to keep hate from outside the club. Hope it resonates. Love y'all. Bye. Go and take a little trip. It's such a future with me. Go and take a little dip. Go and take a little dive. Get that energy right. We gon' get it together. There's the car, the cars, the key clarity. The cars, the cars, the key what you need. Subscribe to my channel.